hey guys welcome back to my channel I'm just gonna do a really quick kind of empties um, not for the month I don't know it's just what I've collected for whatever the last couple of weeks but I finished the um, Clinique Moisture Surge 72 hour and I bought it because Sammy Robinson had it and she looks like Gigi and I want to look like Gigi and I felt like it was the moisturizer that was doing that I'm not really sure either way it's beautiful totally would repurchase love this it's like a gel um, it's like a gel consistency so it feels like so light on the skin you can wear makeup over the top of it and it does not affect it at all it doesn't feel heavy it doesn't feel greasy like it's just beautiful and I'm normal I'd say normal to kind of combination sometimes I can be oily sometimes I can be dry I'm definitely always dehydrated you know what I'm saying like I live in Australia I feel like that's enough said right Batiste Swear by it, love it. Tried the Orbe, 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 O R I B E, whatever that one is. Like, it's like a million dollars. Like, you spray it on your hair and you're like, up oh, $10, up oh, $10, up oh, $10. Well, that felt really nice, actually. Um, and the Way, the Way products, which is what Jenna, is it Jennifer Atkins? I've literally just forgot her name. But anyway, the, the hairdresser that does the Kardashians, and I've tried her dry shampoo. I've tried so many different dry shampoos, and this is, I think it's because I'm blonde. So if you're dark, you get the white cast with this, and you don't like it. But if you're blonde, you get the white cast, and it looks like you've just toned your hair when really, uh-uh, you've got dirty hair, but you made it look clean. You know what I'm saying? Enough said. I will repurchase, have repurchased. I've already got like four more. So the red can also off. This is not even empty. You can see it's kind of like up to here. I don't know. I'm funny now. So my hairdresser told me that I've got to like not use silicon products, and this feels really nice. But she said because it's like an oil, it can make the hair the um your hair turn kind of yellowy. So I'm like, well, that's gotta go. You know, it makes my hair feel nice, but like I don't know if that's good. I don't know any anything about hair let me just put that out there my next product that I'm throwing out that is not actually empty again is the Garnier skin active miracle anti-fatigue wake-up tinted detiring anti-aging care I think it's a moisturizer but it's got a tint in there not into it like I just if I'm gonna moisturize my, no sorry not if I always moisturize my skin I also um, I always like tone my skin I always whatever sorry I just got a message that's why I'm like distracted but that nah don't worry about it Garnier have some actually really nice moisturizers but they feel like they've got a lot of silicon in them actually let's just check where the oh no the ingredients are on here but like the silicons in them so that's why they feel so beautiful going on your skin but apparently I don't know if this is fact but apparently silicons like basically put a layer over your skin so you're not allowing any more hydration to get into your skin, but you're also, do you know, do you know what I'm saying? Like it's not, it's not a humectant, which is going to attract moisture to it. Like I hope that makes sense, but it's not good for your skin in the long term. That's what I mean. This is empty. The anti blemish L'Oreal mask. I actually love the L'Oreal masks and the one, my favorite is the yellow one, the brightening mask. Um, it's got like, it says Yuzu. On it anyway it's beautiful this one's like not completely empty like you can still see a fair bit there but I don't find that I break out as much I'd rather brightening and I'd rather hydrating so I've used a lot of it and I use it more as like a spot or like a section treatment you know what I mean like I'll just put it here whereas where which is where I break out but um, yeah mm, nah yeah you know um, the other one that I'm finished is the Kerastars um, Resistance Serum, whatever. So I bought this, feels really nice. The third ingredient in is Dimethicone, which is a silicon. So not, oh, not anymore. I'm not allowed to use it. My next one, <laughs> I'm like holding it upside down. My next one is my favorite and I actually have gone through like 
I think two of these. I've never repurchased. I've never loved a mascara enough to repurchase it. Let's just put that out there. I don't like wearing waterproof mascaras because I feel like to dry and set to be waterproof, they dry out your lashes as well. I don't know if that's fact or not, but I feel like that's a thing. <laughs> I'm a scientist. But this one um, does not flake. That's one thing I find. Like I'll quite often at the end of like my shift, I'll have like all these black dots up here and it will look like I've never plucked my eyebrows before in my life. And I'll always say to my team, like, why did no one tell me that I look like an ogre? Okay, thanks. Where's the respect? But anyway, so this one does not flake, clump, smudge, move. And this is not a waterproof one. So the Lash Paradise in L'Oreal. And always L'Oreal will go 40% off in Priceline, Chemist Warehouse, Coles, Safeway, wherever. It'll always go on sale. So that's one that I'll always repurchase. Um, the other ones that I've got, oh, sorry, that was a really loud noise, is the Ordinary High Coverage Foundation. I actually got this from a friend. It's definitely, it's just not in my color. Like she's, she's dark, dark. And she got this because, and sorry, she gave this to me because it was not her color, but it's not, it's too dark for me as well. But I don't know, it just didn't, it wasn't like, I wasn't like, oh my God, I need to order this in my color. This um, Tarte Rainforest of the Sea, that's going to, like, I don't know, it was just nothing amazing. Same with the concealer. I actually really like the Doe Foot applicator. Actually, let me show you. Just put those in the bin. It's got that big fat, like, actually, let's compare it to Tarte Shape. Just give me Uno Memento. I actually feel like it's, yeah, it's exactly the same. So Tarte, oh no, is it? It's a little bit smaller. Tarte Shape Tape and the Tarte Rainforest of the Sea, 100%. The, the coverage, you can't even compare them. Like this one, you get more product, do you? Actually, let's have a look at that. Let's put the lid on before I make a mess. But, so this is, dang it, it doesn't say, oh wait. You get 10 mils. Oh, shut up. I think you get less in this. No, I lie. You get 10 mils in both of these. I don't know why, but this lasts forever. Like I've got, I've got two backups and I still, like I probably didn't need to order two backups. Do you know what I mean? Like it just lasts and lasts and lasts. You need the tiniest little bit. Whereas this one you can kind of put on blend out. It's like, oh, it's gone. Blend out again. Oh, it's gone. Apply a little bit more. Huh, I still look tired. It's not a bad product. It's just like, I don't, it's not worth it to me. Like Tarte have so many more beautiful products that I would purchase. Um, the other thing that I've got on in my empties, this is actually, it's actually brand new. I should give this to someone. This is the La Roche-Posay concealer. The La Roche makeup is beautiful. The concealers are probably their one thing that I think let them down. Like they don't, they just don't cover. So I think like, unless you're really sensitive, maybe then the Tarte wouldn't work for you. But like, oh, I don't know. I just feel like these don't give me anything enough to like actually use it. So, um, I was gifted this. Like I'm not, Oh, I shouldn't throw it away. I won't throw it away, but like I'll give it to somebody, but it's not, it just doesn't work enough to warrant using it every day because my skin isn't sensitive. Does that make sense? So I think I'll just keep using my Tarte, give that away and I won't be really purchasing that, but their foundations are beautiful. And if you've got sensitive skin or like if a customer comes in with rosacea or um, psoriasis or anything like that, put their foundation, put the La Roche foundation on them, do one half mate they love it they bloody love it they I've had people tear up about that like it's it's pretty full-on you know what I mean like I don't know anyway sorry for rambling that is my favorites thanks for watching see you guys